buzz personally on your ear, and uh, and how do you feel going into the biggest game of your college career? Um, I mean, on the, on the year as a whole, it was it is, it is what it is. We uh, kind of went into this year knowing we were going to spread the ball out a little more, which I'm I'm fine with. I mean, we had some guys have some career years, do some do some pretty big things, and uh, and get to make a name for themselves, which is which is awesome. I mean, we we definitely left some points on the board in some games, which everyone's going to be a, a little upset about. But personally, with the, my numbers, I had no issues. I mean, we had a running back crack a thousand. That's that's incredible to see, and we got a, a couple receivers with some pretty good totals. Less targets for you this year, more targets for the likes of Wilson Birch, Kyle Van Weinsberg. How much do you feel the pressure has been maybe, let's say, lifted off you? It's nice because, I mean, you go into the huddle and everyone's confident that someone, else, that someone can make the play. Everybody's, everybody in that huddle is, is thinking, if this ball comes to me, I'm catching it, I'm coming down with it, which is an awesome feeling. I mean, I think, I, I think we've always felt that through year one, two, and three. I no, never really thought that nobody else was going to make the play, but it's nice. I mean, you go to your kid playing in high school, it's kind of like, okay, well, everybody and their mom knows who the ball's going to. And now we're now in the, with this team, it's nice to know KY, Wilson, both my roommates, both my best friends, that I know that that ball's thrown to them. I gotta, my heart's not going to skip a beat. You talk about bigger crowd colder weather how do you feel about the environment and what impact it might have on saturday's game um i mean we're all pretty fired up it's the last last game ever i think at richardson stadium before they tear it down and uh and put the, put the turf down so it's gonna be pretty cool i'm sure there's gonna be a lot of alumni a lot of fans there uh the cold i think is only only gonna help us i'd, I'd like to think we're the stronger more physical team um so i mean a little cold weather getting to beat up beat them up in the in the cold could, could help us a lot, a lot and i mean fans are always fun to play against they got their ugly band and their kilt so it's gonna be gonna be exciting Thoughts on, on what looks you might see defensively from Queens? Um, I mean, they're they're pretty base. Uh, they they do a lot of the same things all year. They haven't really changed changed too too much. They've been starting to play a little bit more man to man coverage as the years years gone on. I think they got a little more confidence in those second and third year guys. So I mean, not going to see anything too complex. We're going to see some pretty base stuff. They don't give up big plays. That's their that's their go to as their as a defense. Like they they don't want to limit it. They're limiting eighty yard bombs on the field. So you just got to nickel and dime them. Take what you can get. Uh, finish runs. Guys like Prender guys are coming down to try to pop the ball out there. They like to hit a little bit. So two hands on the ball. To catch, tuck, knife, knife up field, get 10 yards, and re retry it on first down next time.